America built Mach 3 aircraft from titanium. Soviets couldn't get titanium, so they did the impossible. They built the MIG-25 from steel. The problem? At Mach 3, air friction heats an aircraft's skin to over 300 degrees Celsius. Titanium handles this while staying light. Steel. Steel is heavy. Really heavy. Soviet industry in 1960 couldn't produce titanium at scale. No manufacturing processes, no trained workers, no specialized tooling. American analysts later mocked this decision. Primitive, crude, backwards, but Soviet engineers made it work. They used a nickel steel alloy called VNS-2. It could handle the heat. The trade-off was weight. The MiG-25 became one of the heaviest fighters ever built at 41,000 kilograms. This forced bigger engines, which needed more fuel, which added more weight. A vicious cycle solved through brute force engineering. The result? It's an interceptor that could reach 80,000 feet and Mach 2.8, faster and higher than anything America could send to catch it. Not elegant, but devastatingly effective. Sometimes constraints breed innovation. Subscribe for more impossible engineering stories.